Hey everybody, it's Brett, and this 2023 Jeep Wrangler 4xe Sahara is stock number 23J69A. I am here at Summit Automotive in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, your new and used Jeep and Jeep Wrangler headquarters. This 2023 Jeep Wrangler Sahara 4xe has the 2-liter turbocharged 4-cylinder engine. It's paired up with the hybrid technology. It is a plug-in hybrid. It uh, gets you 375 horsepower and 470 foot-pounds of torque. It's also gonna get you 49 miles per gallon equivalent and has an electric, all-electric range of 22 miles, roughly. So you can charge one of these fully charged in approximately two hours with a 240 volt charger and approximately 12 hours with a 120 volt charger. This one does come with the charging uh, plug-in. This vehicle has been fully safety and inspected by our service shop, has a fresh oil and filter change. All the fluids have been checked and topped off. This Jeep is 100% ready to go. I'm gonna go all the way around in this video. Inside, underneath, start it up, take a look under the hood, give you the most accurate representation that I can of the vehicle, and go over all the options as well. High velocity clear coat is the color. Shoot all my videos in 4K. If you like the video, consider subscribing to the YouTube channel. Click the bell notifications and get updates on the videos I do each and every day, as well as having access to one of the largest catalogs of vehicle and specifically Jeep Wrangler walkarounds on YouTube. Almost 500 videos of Wranglers on there and 9,000 videos total. This one comes with the 20 inch gloss black, 20 inch wheels and the hybrids all give you the blue Jeep there. And it has Bridgestone Dueler HL tires. These are 275, 55R20s. I would say they have right around 50 to 60% of the tread left on them. Frame and underbody is exceptionally clean. This is a one owner, clean title history, clean Carfax from right here in Wisconsin. This one does have the color match fenders, the LED headlamps, running lights, and fog lights, as well as the LED uh, halo lights on there as well. Front bumper is in very nice condition. Didn't see any dents, dings, or scuffs on there. You also get the blue tow hooks when you get the hybrid model, the seven slotted grille with the silver inserts. The hood is in fantastic condition. I didn't see any major dents or dings on there. Looks really good. And the passenger side front fender is in excellent shape as well. No scuffs or scrapes. Passenger side front wheel, no scuffs on there. You do get the Jeep lettering outlined in that blue, as well as the blue Wrangler logo or sticker there. You get the Jeep climbing up the side of the windshield and the sandals and the shroud there. And as you go down this side of this 2023 Jeep Wrangler Sahara hybrid, take note of how clean those doors are, how reflective and mirror-like that paint is. I take these HD videos, so if you're far away or even if you're close by and you just cannot make the trip down, but you're still interested in purchasing the vehicle, you can see the vehicle, hear the vehicle, and have confidence in what you're looking at before you even get here. So when you do get here, there's absolutely no surprises and you can make a smart and informed buying decision or make, just make the decision to take a trip and come look at the vehicle. If this video helps you do either of those, let your salesman know that you saw the video, that it was helpful and that Brett sent you then I can keep doing these videos each and every day for our great customers all over the United States. Back wheel's in excellent shape as well. Four wheel disc brakes on the Wranglers. The back tires look like they have just a little bit more tread than the front tires. I'd say probably 60, 65% of the tread on the back tires. Frame and underbody is in excellent shape as well. Didn't see any corrosion under there. Comes with the factory running boards. And as always on these Wranglers, I wanna show you the door hinges to make sure that there's no corrosion on them because that is a very common issue with these vehicles. And this one looks absolutely perfect. Also, we have a video on how to take your doors off your JL Wrangler. If you want to check that video, it's linked in the description below as well as in the upper right hand part of the screen. Coming around to the back, that hard top is in nice shape. The rear bumper is absolutely perfect. No dents or dings on there. You do get the blue tow hook back here, the 4xe lettering on the back as well. Matching spare tire and wheel. So that's a brand new tire. So you can see just how much tread comes on a brand new one. Back storage area is very clean. And there is that charger I was talking about. This is the case for the charger. This is the case for the front hard top pieces. This one does have the Alpine premium sound system with the factory subwoofer. You get the painted bars back here. So when you have that hard top off, 
it actually looks uh, like it's supposed to be off. Get two quick disconnects. There's four bolts on each side to get that hard top off. We also did a demo on how to take your hard top off. If you want to check out that video, that's in the upper right hand part of the screen and linked in the description below. You get a nice storage area back here. You get holders for your door hinge, roof and windshield bolts. You also get these seven slotted panel on the back door here, as well as the JL badge, which tells you wheelbase, overall length and water fording. And this door closes nice and easily. You also get the LED tail lamps on here. Coming around the driver's side, just as clean as that passenger side, no scuffs or scrapes on that rear fender. And the rest of the hard top is in very nice condition. I didn't see any scuffs or scrapes on that or chips. And for full disclosure, this back wheel just as nice as the rest. And down the rest of the side, doors all look really good. And once again, door hinges, very nice condition. Take a quick look at the back seats. So the four by E's are a little different than the normal Wranglers back here. You get the latch child safety system for any child car seats you may have. Now the normal Wranglers, these uh, seats just all fold down in one motion. On the four by E's, this piece goes up first and then this piece goes down. And that's because your batteries for the hybrid system are actually right under the seat and uh, they can't make it go down as flat as the normal Wranglers. So that's really the only difference um, when it comes to the interior on these things. You also get factory floor mats back here. You get two USBs, two USB-Cs, and a 115 volt, 150 watt plug-in. Very nice and clean back here. Child safety locks on the back doors and the inside and bottoms of the doors all look fantastic. Has the enter and go system. Just have to have the key fob in your pocket, put your hand in there and it'll automatically unlock. Inside the Sahara package gives you the black leather bucket seats. No rips or tears back here. You get the Sahara stitched into the backrest. Driver's seat height adjuster, factory floor mats, auto headlamps, tilt telescopic steering wheel, power locks, power mirrors. And then this is your hybrid control system. You, get the, you can put it in hybrid mode, so it uses the gas and the electric. Just electric mode will not turn the engine on. And then the e-save mode just uses the gasoline engine to move you for the most part. You do get side airbags on these seats. Hop inside, check out the miles, the radio, and everything that this Jeep has to offer on the interior. You can see you get the Sahara animation at the beginning there. This one has 19,076 miles on it. You do get the seven inch LCD display, digital speedometer, time, uh, battery life left, and uh, average miles per gallon. You can change all those corners to read pretty much whatever you want. Uh, the instrument cluster is a little different on these. You do have a charge meter right there, as well as your gas meter, and then your tachometer is on the left there. It does come with the heated leather wrap steering wheel, cruise controls on the right, Bluetooth and information center controls on the left, and audio controls on the back of the steering wheel. It does have the Uconnect 4C 8.4 inch radio. Uh, this one does have the factory navigation system. There is Highway 41, so that is working nicely. You also get AM, FM, and Sirius XM radio capabilities. You have heated seats, heated steering wheel controls, as well as your backup camera. They made these backup cameras HD, so they are crystal clear and high definition. You get all your different apps on here. It does have off-road pages and projection manager where you can project your cell phone to the screen. We did a demo with Android Auto. If you want, check that out. See how that system works. That's in the upper right-hand part of the screen. And then you get your off-road pages here. They do take a second to load. So while they're loading, I will show you down here are your more tactile volume tune and climate controls, including your heated seats, heated steering wheel controls, stability control, push button start, speed select crawl control, and you can turn that screen off. There are your power window buttons, USB, USB-C, and AUX jack. So your off-road pages here, you get the Jeep going. You may be stuck, but not, or maybe lost, but never stuck, whatever it said there, um, in a Wrangler. And then once these load up, it's got a couple of really cool features. You can Features you can see the steering wheel angle right there as I turn that steering wheel. Um, those angles change as soon as it loads. Let's see if we got pitch and roll here. So you get pitch and roll, latitude, longitude, altitude. You also have your accessory gauges and then the drivetrain. Once I turn that steering wheel, you can see 
that those angles change there as well. So that's a pretty cool system. You also have your transfer case if it's in too high, four high, um, or auto or four low. So a lot of cool stuff that you can do with this radio. The one button I didn't show you is the recharge mode. So um, you can put it in that and it'll actually use the brakes more to recharge the batteries. So it has regenerative, regenerative braking on it. Um, so that is kind of an interesting mode as well. Down here's your 4x4 shifter, your 8-speed automatic transmission. Keyless entry with remote start. It does have the flipper key on there. And the key fob is in really nice condition. Passenger side, floor mat, and seat are in excellent condition. The other thing to point out on this Wrangler, get those hard top pieces, they're in nice shape. Assistant SOS buttons, auto dimming mirror, and your home link buttons for your garage door security systems and lighting systems. Uh, one little design note here, you get the leather wrapped dash. Uh, in 2024, they replaced this. This is no longer leather wrapped. It's a, kind of a cloth material. So in the Saharas, so that's kind of a different thing. So if you like the leather wrapped dash, 2023 is the last year that you could get that. Anyways, uh, I'm going to start it out. Take a look under the hood. Also check out all the LED lights in the front here because they are super bright. Check out those LED lights in the back. You also get LED license plate lights on there. They look really good. I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today. And hopefully from this HD video, you've been able to verify the quality, condition, the options, and of course, cleanliness of this Jeep Wrangler inside and out. This is where you charge the vehicle with that charger in back. And there are those LED lights. They are super bright. Very nice. This thing is in great condition. And definitely everything I'd want in a Wrangler. My next Wrangler will be a 4x8. Under the hood, we have the 2-liter turbocharged 4-cylinder engine. And once again, when paired up with the hybrid system, it gives you 375 horsepower and 470 foot-pounds of torque. Engine bay is very clean, runs very smooth. Once again, this vehicle has been fully safety and inspected by our service shop. Has a fresh oil and filter change. All the fluids have been checked and topped off. And this Jeep is 100% ready to go. Very nice vehicle. I would recommend this Jeep from a quality and condition standpoint. I'd ship this one anywhere, California, Texas, New York, Florida, wherever. Whoever's going to get this one is going to absolutely love it. And to see more pictures of this Jeep or one of our other 550 new news cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, you name it, we got to go to the website right there, summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle, all at summitauto.com. If you'd like to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto. Click the bell notifications, get updates on the videos I do each and every day, as well as having access to one of the largest catalogs of vehicle and Wrangler walkarounds on YouTube. Like I said, 9,000 videos and counting and almost 500 Wrangler videos on there. In fact, in a second, you will see a link to subscribe to my YouTube channel in the upper left, a link to all the Wrangler videos I've ever done in the upper right, a link to this vehicle on our website in the lower left, and a link to one of our latest YouTube videos in the lower right. Click those, check us out. We're super excited to help you with this ultra clean 2023 Jeep Wrangler Sahara 4xE in high velocity clear coat. Thanks again for checking out the video. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on the YouTube channel. I really appreciate it. Thanks again.